you doing? How's it going? Good. How are we? Hey, so we originally were going to ask you how scoring the first I know. goal I know. <laughs> the history I know. was. However, we've learned since that it may have been, in fact, an own goal from New Mexico United's side. Nevertheless, you you absolutely contributed to the fact that you put that pressure on to score that goal. How did that moment feel like for you? Yeah, I was thinking it could have gone down as an own goal, all right, but I tried to claim it anyway to see because... Um, I was just at the back post and I tried to just stick a leg out and then from that I think kind of my leg and his leg came together but I think it hit off him to be fair so um, but yeah claimed it anyway in front of, in front of the fans you have to so um, yeah no obviously I wish it was mine and I wish the, set, the header I had went in as well it would, would have been perfect but um, yeah good to get something out of the game because more than deserved it more than deserved it I think it would have been a travesty if I think we got nothing out of it because you know we had a lot of chances um, and I think we played really well for most of the game, so um, I think we des we deserved at least what we got. Speaking of that, when you came in in the second half, it seemed like Coach had a more. I mean, you guys were already attacking and aggressive, but it seemed like there was a there was an attempt to claw one back uh, with your substitution. Can you walk us through what was your mindset, what was your game plan as you entered the pitch? Coming coming on, I always like obviously I wanted to get on earlier, but um, whatever time you get, you, you know you have to um, you have to try and make an impact. And um, yeah, I was just trying to make an impact, get in the box, get in the area. Um, probably only got the ball a, a few times, but um, obviously try and do something positive with it and just, you know, just work, run around, work, be busy. The lads are tired. Um, they've worked hard putting in a big shift for, for, for 90 um, or 85 minutes or so when it was when it came in. But um, yeah, no, just try and make an impact, contribute in some way, um, whether that's just working and running, fair enough. But if you can obviously contribute with uh, putting pressure on for a goal or, um, you know, getting chances, then that's better, you know. We didn't see you dress for PC, and we didn't see you start today. That was a surprise for me personally. Can you talk us through? Was there an injury? Was there a knock? Were you just returning to fitness? What was going on? With yeah, that? yeah. I have I've had a little injury then over the course of the preseason. I've missed quite a bit. I haven't got many minutes in preseason. Um, I've kind of been. I came back, like I had a little injury, came back, and then kind of went again. So, um, took a little bit longer than this time. But I'm back now and strong. But. Um, yeah, just minutes wise, I haven't really, I haven't been there. So, um, yeah, working hard to get the fitness back up to, to 100%. But um, um, obviously, getting minutes like today and then getting four weeks of training under my belt will do that. But um, yeah, I haven't really been able to feature as much as I would have liked in preseason. What was it? A foot injury? A leg injury? Just a muscle injury, yeah. Just a muscle injury. So, um, yeah, kind of only small, but the way it happened was just timing was unfortunate with, with games and stuff like that, you know what I mean? If you had scored that goal, who would have got the assist? Noah. Noah Fuson would have got it. He crossed there. It was a good cross. So, um, yeah, I wish he did get the assist because he was brilliant today. But, um, yeah, I wish I got the goal as well. But look, <laughs> what can you do? Is it encouraging signs for you guys to create that many goals Yeah, definitely. I think obviously we'll be disappointed that we didn't take as many. But I think the way we created was, was really good. Um, we had a lot of chances, obviously, two or three maybe three off the post as well. So, um, yeah, just pile on the pressure. Chances, good energy in the team, I thought. Um, everybody just kept working. And uh, the gaffer said to us during the week, he said, especially at home, you know, you can't you can't ever ever say die. And I think we, we kept the pressure on um, throughout the whole game. And, uh, yeah, we got what we deserved in the end. I think, I probably think we deserved three points. But um, when you're 1-0 down and there's a few minutes left, obviously, um, You'll, you'll take it, you know what I mean? You guys can finally take here all the work that's going into this season and get to that point. How, how good did it feel to finally hear, feel that, hear that opening? Yeah, it was it was good. Like, like, it was a good occasion today. I think everyone's kind of been building up to it. But as a player, you try to just focus on the game and kind of not look into everything around us. Like, we've been training here all week and people have been, like, doing everything with the stadium, putting stuff up, making it look as good as it looks. So, obviously, a huge thanks to... Um, everybody who's contributed because massive effort has gone into it and I think today you can see how good it looks um, how good it looked out there and obviously just to build up with a long pre-season and nearly like eight or nine weeks of pre-season so it was all building up to today so um, you know sometimes it can just it can build up and then all of a sudden you're, you're losing a game at home and you're thinking all this for what but um, yeah everyone everyone uh, everyone was just excited to be here and I think I think that showed with the fans and everything. What do you think of the home crowd? Class, the class, yeah. I mean, when you're when you're goal down, when you're goal up, it's the last 10, 15 minutes. It's always um, 
that's when you need them the most. You know, it's obviously great when you come out, but when you're pushing for an equalizer or you're trying to hold on to a win at home, massively important to uh, to have those fans there and obviously behind the goal, but not just there, everywhere to be fair. Um, but it was nice to have that moment at the end where we scored and you know we could celebrate because um, I think we deserved that. And then you know we we pushed on and could have had another one. And uh, can only imagine the scenes if we did. But look, we'll uh, we'll go again. Are you ready to uh, travel to California? Yeah, ready to travel wherever. Um, yeah, that's going to be obviously a big part of it, a bit, a bit of a change for me as well. Um, but I'm looking forward to it. I think, you know, wherever we go, um, so far everything's been done, you know, perfect, no complaints. Um, so I'm sure it's going to be the same. And um, you have to kind of have to learn how to manage games on the road. And um, that's just part of it. So, yeah, looking forward to it for sure. Thanks, no Thanks, Thank you.